Welcome back. You've seen it on train cars and under bridges. It's an art form, though, many of us might associate with crime, but not in this case. News Channel 5's Austin Pollock brings us a story where graffiti isn't a crime. It's actually a connection. Oh, man. Oh, monkey business with you. No, we aren't talking about you. Carry on with your monkey business. Every wall is different and unique. Unique yet unifying. Well, don't look back. Well, keep faking it until I make it. Just make it. Pop. I always thought that when I'm painting, I can make I can make a ruckus. That's how you know that was the whole thing behind that. That's Rosalia, Christian, Matt, Ann and Rose. All right, got through them all. You are my brother-in-law's. Sister. They're also visitors to the Walls Art Park in Waverly for the Spring Paint Jam, a weekend for graffiti artists to take a stab at a craft that catches your eye. And, yep. yes, legally. This is a legal place for them to paint whatever they want. A lot of times my perception is graffiti artists come out at night. It's a great concept, and, and the fact that it's in nature is um, it's fantastic. It's amazing. Not all artists are Tennesseans. Matt here is from Atlanta, and you don't always know who will be your neighbor. I mean, I met a couple guys today. They're painting on the bigger wall up here. A few of them... I know them, they don't know me because I follow them, as I mentioned, really incredible artists. Christian has learned part of Rosalia's story. Since she's moved out, she's 19, she's moved out, she's about to get her uh, bachelor's degree in accounting and... It's just overall a bonding experience in this crazy world that we live in. What's that, love? Oh, I lost you, where'd you go, the other side? If you haven't figured out how they're related... It's my daughter. <laughs> okay, now you know. My daughter wanted to learn graffiti after We'd be stuck at the train stop, and you see all the cars go by, and she thought the colors were awesome. And that's her name. Her nickname is Ruckus. And I spell it R-U-K-U-Z. Yeah, and this, this celebrates graffiti as an actual art. So what's the deeper meaning here? Part of me feels sad that it's not more commonplace, but it also makes me feel like I've accomplished something in developing a solid relationship with my children. I take it while I can. I make time for him, and he makes time for me. I'm Austin Pollock, News Channel 5.